So in this video, we are checking out this G for free pickleball bag. If you're looking for a simple bag to take to the pickleball courts, you can't go wrong with this one. Uh, now this was sent to me for testing and review, just in full disclosure, but let's go ahead and check this out. So right away, you have your pocket right here for your pickleball paddle. Perfect size for one or two paddles, but I do have to take a note here. This is not big enough for your paddles to have a cover on. So we have my paddle right here, and I'll just go ahead and show you guys. It's not very big enough for me to have a paddle on my, or a cover on my paddles, but if I take the cover off, fits just fine. And there's probably enough room for maybe one more paddle but you can definitely fit one in there just fine. Now, if you're using a different size paddle, you are gonna have a lot more room. So you can see with this paddle, I can only fit one, but if we go ahead and take this out and we check out these paddles, they're much skinnier than this one paddle. So you're gonna see right away if I go ahead and twist it so you don't want the handles to be next to each other. Both paddles fit in there just fine. So it's just going to depend on what kind of paddles you have on how it's going to fit. So outside of this front pocket for the paddles, you do have a, another front pocket right here that has some dividers in there, okay? You have two water bottle pockets, which they are stretchy. You have your main pocket, and you like to, I like to call this an anti-theft pocket. It's right here on the back. This is probably where you're gonna wanna put uh, some more secure items that you don't want people necessarily going through your bag for, just because the pocket is, you know, it's right here on your back, and it is a little bit more out of sight to where if someone was to walk up to your bag, they're not necessarily going to see that pocket right away. And then you do have your main pocket, and this is where you could also even fit another paddle or two in here if you wanted. I would say, depending on your shoe size, it's big enough for a pair of shoes as well. But, you know, you know, if you have like big size 13s or something, maybe not. And if you notice, something else I really wanted to point out was sometimes, so I have a regular backpack, it's actually not tall enough for some of my pickleball paddles to fit. Whereas this bag, you can see the paddle that I have there to where you could fit another paddle inside here and it doesn't reach the top, which means it's gonna be very easy for you to zip up the bag. Then we do have uh, you know, some slight cushioning on the back here and you even have a whistle and a chest strap, which is pretty cool that they included that. Gonna make it very easy to get to the courts and make your bag comfortable. So if you're looking for a basic pickleball bag, we have straps on the outside as well to where you could put even more stuff. I would say probably put maybe a, a sweat towel or something to wipe off with on the front right here within these bungees so it doesn't have to go inside. But you have this bag here, I would say two to three paddles could fit in here, just depending on the size of the paddles. Because like I said, this one, only one would really fit in the front. But then these two, I was able to fit two paddles right there in the front. Um, and then you definitely have room for an extra pair of clothes, socks, some snacks, drinks, whatever you would want to have a good day out of the courts.